Hi folks, if you have a clog in your house, a blockage in your house and water is backing up, you may think it's common sense that where the water is backing up is where your clog is, but that's really not true. And I want to give you some really helpful information on how to find and how to understand where a clog would be coming from if you have one in your house. So if this is your home, And this is your basement. And here's your first floor. You're going to excuse my artwork. It might not be the best. You have typically, you have a pit. You have your sewer coming out. You have a house trap that's U-shaped. You have your underground plumbing. You may have a shower here. You may have a toilet here, and you may have a sink. That would be your basement. You would also have plumbing that goes up to your first floor. Well, likewise, you can have a sink. You can have a shower, if that makes sense to you. Now, I'm gonna to switch to blue. You can have water pouring out of the floor and you shower and you can easily think that you have a shower clog but that's not so water seeks its own level water seeks the path of least resistance so in other words if you had a main sewer clog if you had a clog in the trap if the caps are on tight this water will back up until it has a place to get out. That would be a shower. That would be your lowest fixture. Now, if you didn't have a shower, you know, most basements don't have a shower, it would then be your next lowest fixture. So you could easily have water pouring out of your toilet and you don't have a toilet clog. That's just the lowest point in the house. You could have a clog anywhere past that point. That's where frequently a professional is really the person you call because if you lift a plug and you have a, 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 a clog from the street, you're gonna be in a lot of trouble. Just think about that. Now the same thing actually is in upstairs. If this is a shower and you got water coming out of your shower and you're standing in a pool of water, you very well might not have a shower clog. You can have a clog further down the line. Well, this is called <clears throat> a stack. You can have a blockage in the stack. And again, that could be blocking all the water draining from the first floor, but where will it come out? The lowest point at your shower. If you have a blockage in the stack, this is your stack that goes down to your house drain. I hope that information helps you out there. I know that homeowners get confused all the time and they spend needless time trying to solve a problem that they really don't understand. Thanks for listening. Thank <laughs> you.